Oh! <gasps> is there someone in there? Hello everybody, my name is Jared and welcome to Jared Gaming. Welcome to a game called Dead Cruise. No, this is not about Tom Cruise on <gasps> Timely Demise. This is about being on a cruise ship and maybe we're dead. Maybe there are dead things. I don't know, never played it before. Let's just dive straight in. I booked this cruise to get away from work, from all those annoying people I see every day. I don't really like people all that much. Relatable. So why not go on a vacation alone? If I had known that people were really capable of, I would have stayed home. What do you mean, good sir? What happened to you? Right mouse button to flashlight. Oh god. Oh, look at that lovely sunrise. Sunset? I know how things are. Locked. So we're <laughs> just on a cruise ship by ourselves? Was this planned? Ew. Ew. Question mark? Ugh, this smell. What could it be? Oh, man. Oh, this is creepy. Big old sh ship. Oh, God. I know this cruise was supposed to be an escape from my everyday life, but I assumed that we had a destination. As far as I can tell, we are just going in a straight line towards the open sea. Well, that's kind of like how cruises and ships and journeys start. You just pick a direction and go. What's supposed to be out there? An island with luxurious resort? Guess we will find out once we are there. Maybe I should lower my expectations a bit. Being able to go on a cruise for this price is nothing short of a miracle. Would be interesting to know how many people applied for a room on the ship. Maybe I got lucky just this once. Maybe I got lucky just this once and I'm on this entire cruise ship by myself. I don't need that much closet space for one week. Ooh, an apple a day keeps the doctor away. But he's not hungry, so the doctor's coming. I'll just leave my stuff in the suitcase. So, have we just arrived or something? Did we just arrive? Hello, hello, what is this? This weird symbol wasn't here before. Well, I wouldn't know. I just started the game. Know what's here and what isn't supposed to be here. Okay, let's go Ooh. I mean, that's blood, right? I mean, cruise... What? Oh. We have no choice. Hmm. And another strange symbol. What the frick are these symbols? Room two, anyone home? It's locked. Room three, also locked. Okay, great. This is turning out to be a great cruise. Oh, God. Everything's bloody. And everything's locked. Symbols do... Oh, I hate that. Oh, that's the worst. Was that someone knocking on a door or was that someone running up behind me? Either way, those are horrible things. Deck one, I need a key card code, keypad, oh, oh, the symbols, do I need to remember the symbols, dang it. A few moments later. Okay, I've gone and noted all of the symbols and I'll try to see if this works, I'm assuming it's in the order from my room to here. So I think that, 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 and that. Bloop bloop, we did it, we are brilliant. What a great little escape room cruise ship where you have to figure out puzzles to them, but to get around the crew the, oh god what are these cots okay um i don't like these <laughs> i don't like um short circuit ah shorts oh frick oh what did we do oh no okay maybe it's just that time is this camera? Is this. Yo, do we need to turn off the camera? <gasps> you got spotted by a security cam! And it thought I was supposed to be here. I paid to be here, dadgummit. Okay, so we can't let the camera see if that's why we can turn it off. Okay. Here we go. <gasps> Ooh. Ooh. Ooh -hoo -hoo -hoo. Can it see me through the, it can't see me through the slits, right? <sighs> we'll find out. Okay, we're safe. Uh, board it up. I could remove this with some kind of tool, like maybe your hands. <laughs> What's with all the cots? These look like, I don't know, like, like the kind of cot you'd like load up into an ambulance or something. What do we got here? Use breaker. Ah, re relies. What? 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 I might make I'm making a symbol here clearly, right? Okay, let's see if we can find a clue somewhere first. Maybe there's a symbol like the, what we need to actually make, or we just have to guess our way through. What is this? I don't know. It's a key. 
And I don't know to what, and I don't have an inventory. Okay, well, I guess we should just go try some room doors until we can open one. Maybe it's for this door. Nope. Okay, breaker, breaker, this is... Uh, sh What? I could deactivate the system, but I need pliers! So we're stuck over here. Oh, man. Okay. <laughs> okay. Unless there were some pliers up here I missed. I think we're stuck here until we figure this weird little door puzzle out. Let me do one quick sweep to make sure we didn't miss some pliers. None of these open. Great. Okay, this might... Well, let's just, just work on this till we figure it out. Hey, 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 complete and utter blind luck. Just pressing buttons. Sometimes that's all you need. It's a little bit of blind luck. Flyers. Oh, a hammer. Another. Something knows we figured it out with blind luck and is not happy with us right now. Crap. Why did we come on this cruise? Whose bright idea was it to come on this damn cruise? Oh, that's right. It was my idea. Deactivated! And we've got two room keys. Can't wait to explore some people's rooms who are probably dead. Do they get a discount for dying? Okay, room number five. Ah, this is one of them. Ugh. They don't like it. There's so much blood. I mean, let's check behind the curtain thing. No, okay. Shouldn't search around other... Are you kidding me, dude? Like, everyone's dead. We gotta figure out how to get out of here. That's not my property. Are you serious? You're worried about property? Okay, let's oh, we'll read their journals, our personal journals. My therapist said I should write more of my dream diary, so here we go. I don't know what is about this ship, but it's given me the chills, like something horrible has happened here before. I like how this person has the same handwriting as we do. I keep having nightmares, but unlike the ones I have at home from time to time, these ones come back. It's funny how we have this instinct to trust people with our lives just because they look like they know what they're doing. Maybe I'm reading into this feeling too much, although over the years I've learned to trust my gut. Usually it's right about those kinds of things, but we're out on the middle of the Pacific Ocean with nowhere to go, so I'll just have to endure this cruise for the remainder of the week. I'm so happy to see my husband again soon and not feel this anxiety anymore usually being on a boat does not affect me but this time it's different i mean maybe it's because it's a big boat and everyone's dead and we're in the middle of nowhere and you're probably dead too those are things god more reading my beloved richard i hope your business trip is just as restful as my vacation so far i know you are the biggest fan of marine biology but i'm quite pleased with my research so far and i'm excited to share my discoveries with you over a nice cup of tea once we're both home again thank you again for this beautiful gift how did you even manage to pay for a cruise like this i hope you didn't use any of our savings anyways i miss you and i can't wait to see you soon annie what great jokes, Annie. Not so funny now, is it? Okay, well, there was nothing in there but notes. Room number four. Uh, there's something on the table. I gotta check behind this. Always check. Always. Use smartphone. Well, what, now we're not worried about going through someone's personal stuff? Oh my god, this person's loaded, Grandma. Grandma's got a lot. What is this from Grandma? Is this Grandma giving us money? Man, gra Grandma's loaded. Pack things for cruise. Tell Mr. Sullivan to accept packages while I'm gone. Give Emily the keys and tell her where the cat food is and what plants to water. Pray that Emily does not forget anything. Don't put charger in the suitcase. Put it in my backpack for the flight. Smart move, whoever you are. Cookies. What? Oh, it's cookie clicker. Oh, hell no. Okay, more, oh god, more notes. Hang in, guys, we got more notes. Hey, babe, there's no internet on this damn ship because why would there be, right? It's not like we live in the 21st century or anything. Anyways, I talked to one of the crew members. They said that we could write a letter and they would send it to you via fax or something. Talking to any of the staff is a bit weird. They're all extremely friendly, but not normal people friendly. More like on drugs friendly. They treat me and the other passengers like guns. Not even kidding, it's creeping me out to be honest i think they sacrificed you to the elder gods human mind by dr carter hmm 
and a crowbar, which we can now use to get through the boarded up um, door. This whole time I've had that feeling like we're, just, we're, we're gonna get jump scared at any moment. It's really setting me on edge, <laughs> again, on edge. But it's just this like false sense of security because nothing's happened. Boards, I've got your arch nemesis, the crowbar. Yay, oh, and the crowbar broke. This must be Breath of the Wild. Music or ambience? Oh good, more reading. I told you to keep your keys in your own rooms. Do you want anyone to get suspicious? I even saw one of the keys laying around on the second deck. Take care of that immediately. Les, leaving a sticky note on the walls. Definitely, um, you know, nice secret way to send messages to people. Oh, God. Okay. Yeah, I mean, look at that. I mean, the symbol on the door, now there's the exact same symbol on the rug in here. I mean, it's 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 an occult thing. It's the occult. Like, hmm. I'm not sure if what I just heard was in the game or I can't make a noise. But what I do know is we get more reading to do. Oh, room one, Michael Sankari, age 30, status unresolved, Lewis status immolated. Todd immolated, Lena, Im what does that mean? What does immolated mean? That's like burned, right? Immolated? Uh, they're burning people. They're burning people as sacrifices. I, I hate not being able to see. I mean, I, once again, we we're presented with an indie horror game with an absolute garbage flashlight. Okay, locked. I mean, something's going to come running at us down the hallway from the darkness at some point. Yeah. I hate it when the door is open. I should like it, but I don't. More keys! Nice. And more reading. Hey there, Mom. I finally found a job. I'll be working for six months on a cruise ship. How awesome is that? I'll be making money and travel the world at the same time. I won't be home for half a year, obviously, but my new chef said the work I'll be doing is very important, yet that there are only a handful of people capable of doing my job. All of this is so exciting. I can't wait to come home and tell you all about it. Love you very much. See you soon, Toby. Oh, the sound? Oh, just all the sound stopped for a second, and it freaked me out. I wonder what they keep in there. Well, now I, it's someone else's property. What do you What do you care? Okay, great, wonderful, great, and wonderful. Let's. Oh, what do we have here? Can't crawl, right? You need something to. What? You need something to. What? What do you mean? You need something to pry it open with? Why do we need to get in this locker and none of the other lockers? I'm so terribly confused by your logic, sir. Key. Key. Okay, all right. Well, oh, is that? Oh, I thought that was a guitar. It's an oar. Can I swing it? Let me swing it upon thee. Ah, key. <laughs> is the oar for prying open? I mean, that doesn't really make sense, does it? But hey. Okay, we just needed a little leverage. We couldn't crawl. We can't be bothered to get on our hands and knees and soil our fine clothing. Music? I mean, I call, I say it's music, but it's more like ambience. What is this? I cannot crouch. Click cat figurine. What? Okay. I caught a cat figurine. Good for us. What is this? What is it? How am I supposed to read this? Uh. I'm not sure what that is. Maybe like the ocean floor. Oh wait, no, that's um, that's the that's the middle of the ocean. We got Asia, Indonesia, Japan, Australia down there. Now oh, there's a location in the middle of the ocean, and I'm assuming we're headed to it. <gasps> Chess. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Do I have to checkmate? Is this my piece? Oh. Okay, did I guess we did the right move in like one try. We're a chess master! Oh my god! Damn, you actually got it? Consider me impressed. Here is your price. I stole this Polaroid from the captain's room. What the frick is that thing? What do what we do this for? It is the Elder Gods. It's the um, it's the fish people. Dear Mastermind Eric, honestly teaching you chess is a bit tiring, so I have to set up a few exercises for you. At least then I don't have to watch you fail over and over again, but hey, if you get it right, there's a pro there's a pr there's a price? If you get it right, there's a price? You mean a prize? Cool, right? All you have to do is tell me which position the knight cannot reach in three moves. Don't be confused, the knight is actually a horde. Okay, I, I already figured it out. 
one try. Totally didn't guess, totally am an actual chess master in real life. <laughs> okay, what did I get in here? Did I find another key? I don't think we found another key. Okay, well, we're, yeah, we're definitely dealing with... Oh, look, another cat figurine. Hmm. I'm curious what are the cat figurines for? What do the cats have to do with the, um... Oh, <gasps> cat! A cat! How many cats do I need to open the cat door? Oh, it's a secret. Oh! <gasps> Is there someone in there? What the fuck? There is! Oh, and they got a flashlight. Oh, that is so creepy. <laughs> He's the most inobservant person to ever exist, I'm assuming. You'll never see me. <laughs> I hear some strange music. Oh, I see a cat figurine. I'm getting that on the way. Got him. Woo. <laughs> I'm the great cat figurine burglar. What am I? What? Oh. What am I getting? Oh, I got keys? I think we got keys. I'm hearing some strange music. The ritual has begun. Okay, alright. Flashlight back, please. Do I have all the cat figurines now? Man, does that mean we... I mean, I haven't seen any before. I gotta find all the cat figurines. Okay, I don't know where this key leads us. Perhaps this door? Oh, command deck. Oh, person in bed. Call for help it ending. Hold on, hold, hold on. Um, that's their captain. Just, and again. I can't do this anymore. I don't want to do this anymore. We do this purely to keep something horrible from happening. Our ancestors knew they had to do it, and so did we. Trust me, if there was another way, nobody could get hurt like this, but sometimes a sacrifice is necessary for the greater good. I'm sorry for the people on this ship. We try our best to make sure the last days are the best they can. Okay. Sacri oh, sacrifice yourself is an ending. Calling for help is an ending. What about grabbing the gun? Hey, Captain! Oh, shit! Is that a sacrifice? That's a sacrifice, right? Oh, I can't leave. Oh, God! I mean, what's the point? What is the freaking point? What about my cat figurines? Damn it! Okay, well, I guess we should sacrifice ourselves because, you know, we just did a horrible thing. Oh, God. Yep. Oh, maybe we can kill whatever's gonna come for us. Oh, is there going to be something outside in the ship here? Oh, oh my god! <laughs> you decided to believe the cult and sacrifice your- Is that what I did? You will never know if the ritual was completed correctly, but you hope that the people on the mainland are safe for now. Oh. You decided to take revenge and shoot the cult leader. I collected three out of five figurines. Dang it! Oh. But I want to find the rest of the stuff. But I don't want to start all over from the beginning. Oh, decisions. I guess I'll try to find all the daggum cat figurines. One eternity later. Okay, I think we just got the last cat figurine. They're actually in different locations this time around, so the chain the lo so the location of the cat figurines changes from each playthrough. What have oh my god. They worship some sort of cat demon. Instructions, purify the participants, set up hearth, speak, prayer, sever participant's spine, open up the body, inspect the inner organs, sever participant's head, offer the body to the sea, celebrate the participants, follow the exact order under any circumstances, make it painless, we do not want to cause more harm than we have to. It's so weird. Wait, am I... Am I going to perform some ritual? Yeah, might as well? What do you mean? What do you mean, might as well? Am I actually supposed to do this somehow? Like, with the captain, maybe? Because he's the only other person other than the crewmate with the flashlight. Uh, I'm not exactly sure, because once you go into that room, I think the door locks behind you. Yeah, because once you come in here... 
pretty sure this door is going to close. Yeah, once you pick up the gun, the door just closes. So I don't know if there's actually a way you can do anything. Cult leader. You've been purified. Maybe that's the clue to, like, sacrificing ourselves. Or something. I'm going to call for help. <laughs> we already did the other ending. Ending one, you did not believe the cult and sent out a distress signal to the mainland. You got rescued and offering was left incomplete. The fate of the world is unclear for now, but you are alive. You decided to take revenge on the cult leader. You also collected five out of five figurines. Yay us. And there you have a guy's dead cruise. I really enjoyed it. It was really creepy the whole time. Just feeling of dread. Feeling like something was going to jump out at us. Nothing ever did, but I do like the Lovecraftian influence. I'm assuming that's what that is. Fish people, deep ones, and all that. I was really hoping we could do something with the cat room, and maybe there is, and maybe I just didn't figure it out, but that's where we're gonna end it. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please leave a like, please leave a comment. If you guys know of any other endings or secrets, feel free to let me know in the comments. And if you're new to the channel and you like cruises and you like Elder Gods, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Leave a like, maybe introduce yourself down in the comments. Say hello, and I'll say hi back. And as always, thank you so very much for watching. You've been awesome. Let's play again soon, and I'll see you in the next video.